This is SAT 5, calculator section, question 14. We have a survey of general surgeons and orthopedic surgeons on their major professional activity. If one of the surgeons is selected at random, which is closest to the probability that the selected surgeon is an orthopedic surgeon whose professional activity is research? In each of these questions, you want to find a numerator and a denominator. And that fraction will give you the probability of what they're asking for. And I do these as almost separate questions. The first question is always, what is the denominator? How many individuals are there who could have been selected from the group where you're making your random selection? Here they said we've selected one of the surgeons, and if everybody is a surgeon, so that would be the total for the entire table. Our denominator is 607 individuals who are surgeons, any of whom might have been selected. Now we want the numerator. Of all those surgeons, which ones are orthopedic surgeons whose professional activity is research? So you go to the row for orthopedic and the column for research, and that would be 74. So our, our probability of orthopedic and research is 74 over the total number of surgeons, which is 607. And this is a calculator question. So I'll take 74 over 607, and I get 0.122, which is choice A. In these questions, you're always looking for the numerator and the denominator, and then reread to make sure you've identified the two groups properly. The denominator is the group from which you choose the random in individual, and the numerator is from that group which individuals count as a success that you're looking for the probability of having. That's all for this problem. Come back soon for my next SAT math video. With math, there's always more.